hate it when my nerves are like this. I hate it when I'm all like frazzled and ugh. Holy cow, that's like already gone. Yeah. <laughs> You've only had it lit for not even five minutes. Mama, look at this. Hi, Cole. Hi, Cole. Hi, Cole. What? I wasn't. He, he pulled me. He's like, come outside. And I was like, okay. <laughs> I know I should have, as you were lighting it though, I was like, dang, I should have yeah. had that on video. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh dear. Oh, I gotta get the thing out. I can't have the camera get wet. Hello. It is Saturday the 8th. And I am running super quick to the post office to mail. I had one more thing that sold yesterday, but she didn't pay till uh, after I'd already been to the post office. So I'm getting hers out today. And then um, that lens, that wide angle lens that I got for the camcorder, uh, I think I'm gonna return it. I asked them you know, what their return policy was and stuff. So, and I have to pay for shipping. It was free shipping to me, but I have to pay for shipping if I wanna return. So I'm gonna see how much it's gonna cost to ship it back and if it's under five dollars then I will do it if it's over then I won't do it because he was going to give me five dollars to keep it <laughs> so I would be out like ten dollars so I'm just trying to weigh my options or if it's garbage it's absolute garbage as I've been looking back editing and stuff when you're using the camera and the little lens that's on the camera you can't really tell how bad it is until you get it to the editing software and really watch it back and it's just absolute piece of garbage like I cannot believe first of all they have not changed their ad on eBay so they are scamming people and I'm, I did a review video on the lens so I'm gonna update that and let everybody know do not I already did say scam or whatever but I'm gonna really say like do not buy from these people they are a total scam they're lying they're not selling what they said they are and it's absolute garbage it looks horrible so it's like a tighter shot would be better without this thing on it. So anywho, I'm gonna see how much it's gonna cost to ship it back. And you only get, have 10 days uh, to use the RMA number or whatever. So I've, and it's already been four days, so I've got to get this thing back over there. So do not buy from Beach Camera on eBay. It sounded, I was like, ooh, that sounds like a legitimate company. It's from New Jersey, so hey, it's gonna be pretty good. No, don't do it. So yeah, so I'm headed to the post office to do that, and I have been super crazy busy today. I've been editing because we lost our uh, internet yesterday because of the windstorm, so I wasn't able to uh, upload a video. Plus, I didn't even have it edited because I've been so busy, and like my nerves are just like run ragged. I, like I'm all shaky right now. Plus, I need to eat lunch, but I have just been go 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 getting stuff done and the house is a complete disaster because I have not really been home so I've been editing it's uploading now I today's video is uploading now and I got the kitchen clean Hannah had a humongous accident last night which was very odd because she went to the bathroom before she went to bed so she just must have had like been in a deep sleep or something I don't know and uh, so I've been cleaning that up poor thing I feel horrible for her and I want to uh, do a video with them today, if I can, for their channel. I don't know if I don't have time for that. And then we have a gazillion cans. I have one bag that I'm taking back now that was ready to go. We have a gazillion cans that you literally can't get into our garage right now, barely. So I'm going to be working on that as soon as I get home. And then I need to edit another video for tomorrow. And I need to keep cleaning. Then my mother-in-law called and was asking, or texted, and was asking about Easter. I need to get that figured out because we're supposed to be hosting that. 
and I totally forgot about that because we only kind of mentioned it one time and we haven't talked about it since. Uh, so yeah, just crazy. And then tomorrow, uh, Toys R Us is having an Easter event that I wanted to take the kids to and I can't remember what time it was but we were invited to a barbecue and I think they're happening at the same time so now I don't know if we're going to be able to do that so it's just crazy 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 craziness I hate it when my nerves are like this I hate it when I'm all like frazzled and ugh. okie doke that was nice and quick very very awesome the guy in front of me that reeked like weed know what he was doing because he was too high so he got out of line so I got to move forward so that was exciting welcome to Oregon where everybody reeks like weed and yes I'm judgmental because that is the equivalent of if I reek like alcohol sorry I totally do not agree you're supposed to be doing it recreational in your home not smoking it in your car as you're around driving around doing errands people <sighs> Anywho, uh, it only was two eighty-five to ship the lens, so I went ahead and shipped it back because it is an absolute piece of garbage. So I'm out two eighty-five out of the whole thing. But what do you do? It's better than keeping it. It's completely useless. It makes the videos look horrible, and it and not only can you see the it's vignetting or whatever, you can see the sides of the lens. Like when I move, it's really weird, but it catches the lens. It catches flares really bad. So not good. And I know I could add a hood or whatever to, but it's like no, the thing's not good anyways. So got that back. Got the. Pajamas shipped. So we are good. I almost forgot to say too, I went to the can place and immediately had to leave because there was absolutely no parking spaces there, which I knew it was going to happen. This is the first Saturday since uh, they doubled the price of the cans. So could not get in, couldn't find a parking space, and I only had one bag to take. So, and my main thing was I was trying to get to the post office anyway, so I decided to skip that just go back during the week when there's less people there. I mean, even now there's people pulling in and there's no nowhere for them to go. That place, I've never seen it that packed. Ah, so yeah. So I'm just gonna go back home now and start working on getting all of our bags backed up or cans backed up so that I can start taking them during the week. So, cause you can put, they want you to not bring more than two cans per day or two bags per day. Um, sometimes I bring three but uh, I want to start, and you, but you can bring them every day and you could go to multiple locations. So I could like drive all over the place and bring two to three per location. But I think I'm just gonna, it's just, I usually just do it if I'm running errands. Like I'm not gonna make a trip just to take cans in, even though that's gonna be almost $20 now. So it might be worth it, I don't know. Okay, so this is what I'm working on. This is our mound and this is just from like one week. So I'm going to get all these have to be bagged up in these green bags. So I'm going to get to work and earn us some money. Okay, so here's two. I'm putting them in our storage room. And here's the rest of them. There's 16 and a half bags. So it'll be exciting to see how much this all comes to. It's a lot of hard work. <laughs> 